I give you this ring to wear with love and joy. I choose you to be my wife. Congratulations, guys. We love you. Your journey began that moment you first got together on that tequila-soaked night. Since then, you took the time to learn what makes the other person smile, what makes them laugh, and how to best support them when life is less than simple. We're so glad that Lindsay and Steve found each other. Sometimes, what you're looking for is right in front of you. Family and friends of the bride and the groom, Thank you for being here on such a special day to witness and to celebrate the marriage of Lindsay Ryan Bartleson and Steve Sean Burke. Steve and Lindsay's connection goes back to their early years, growing up just a grade apart in school, attending Peter Fitz, and another surprising twist of fate our mom grew up in Westford, which coincidentally revealed connections to Tom's cousin, the Wojcik's, who are also here. Finally, the tale comes full circle when Lindsay and I became friends through Lauren in 2010. And although it took a long 10 years for Steve to get the courage and realize that Lindsay was the one all along, I think the timing of it was perfect. Don't mess up my hair. <laughs> beautiful. Oh my God. You're beautiful. Mm -hmm. Steve, you are my favorite person, my favorite pair of eyes to look into, and my favorite hug at the end of the day. I couldn't ask for a better man to spend the rest of my life with. You've always been my biggest cheerleader, and I vow to always be yours. Here's to us, our love, and to deciding to do forever together. I love you, and I love you till my lungs give out. Let's do this. Here in the company of friends and family, do you willingly and lovingly take each other in the partnership of marriage with all the responsibilities and joys that such a union brings? agreeing to stand beside each other in good times and in bad for all the days of your life. We do. We do. We do. By the power vested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may now kiss your wife. Today is a reminder of what your love has already accomplished, as well as the amazing possibilities of what it can continue to achieve in the years ahead. John Lennon once says, a dream you dream alone is only a dream. A dream you dream together, now that is a reality. That new reality starts now. All, right, all of you, all our guests here, are very important to us. And we thank you very much for traveling near and far to come here and celebrate Lindsay and Steve. Here's wishing them enough, enough of anything and everything they possibly could need. At a rooftop bar in New York City about 10 years ago now, uh, Lindsay proclaimed that she was not going to get married until she was 43 years old. Well, 
She's not 43 yet as far as I know, so. What I love most about Lindsay is her willingness to always go on an adventure. We have shared so many memories and good times and I can't imagine ever not being your friend. People always ask me if it's weird that my brother and my best friend are together and my answer has always been no. Because the truth is, Lindsay, our family doesn't feel complete without you in it and we are so lucky to have you as part of it. And now I can officially say that you're my sister. Today, seeing you so happy while you marry your best friend, and mine actually, has brought tears to my eyes and I couldn't be happier for you both. We get married to share our lives with one another, the burdens of life, the achievements, big and small, and you only get to share your truest version of yourself with a few people, and I think that is one of life's greatest gifts. Through thick and thin, you will always be together. So let's raise a cup to the Burks, now, then, and forever.